guapo, guapo. Hi Blueberry, it's Harry again. I think it's been quite a long time since I last do an English video, so today I'm gonna do one. As the title says, this video is gonna be my first ever emoji food challenge. The other day I posted a story on Instagram asking you guys to drop some emoji in the questions. I said multiple accepted, but that's where the problem started. My followers started to actually flooding the question section with all the emoji that I don't think that I could ever finish till the end of my life. Like some even send insects. How, how do you think I can eat that? So today I'm just gonna eat some of the, I mean, basic thing that I can find that look identical to the emoji on the iPhone. As I'm having lunch today, I can show you guys what I have today and I swear this look identical to the emoji on the phone. I got some dumpling or you can call it mandu, some cabbage, don't mind this. The main point is this thing. And I'm showing you guys uh, an emoji, iOS emoji of Mandu on screen right now. You can see that it looks exactly the same. And I'm gonna give it a go right now. I'm so excited. Mandu is one of the most favorite thing that I could eat like all year round. Can you see it? It looks exactly the same as the emoji. Hmm. So good. I have a bit of soy sauce here. Mm. The mandu feeling is seafood. I have some dessert. These also look like the emoji, so I will eat it. This one too. Strawberry. It's a bit sour. I'm so hungry, I need some snacking. Let's go, let's go. See what can I have. I got this. I don't know if this counts, but I will show the emoji that I think it looks like on the screen right now. Do you wanna have something to snack on right now? I think it looks like the churros. Um, we'll see that. Honestly, I don't think it looks like any of the emoji, but I just eat it. The crunch. How to dip the snack into the Joker is gonna be a very good combination, I can tell that. Mm. Doing some grocery shopping? There's always kind of like end of day sale and I'm waiting for that. This is the new tea. I don't think it looks like the emoji, but yeah. I'm currently going for the end round. So cheap, I'm telling ya. Got 50% discount and I'm taking it all. This is what I got. Many rounds of shopping. Today is the next day and I'm gonna eat this thing that I got from the GN sale last night. You can tell that most of these looks like the emoji, even the cucumber. I organize it to look like exactly like the emoji. And then we have the sushi. This is a rice bowl. Okay, let's have breakfast. I don't think there's anyone having sushi for breakfast. But that will only be me. I have this rice bowl first. Mm. 
the moment I touched the banana tong, I know that I couldn't eat it cold. Now I have some sushi. Sushi for breakfast. Itadakimasu. Mmm. Ooh. Pudding. Let's have a bite. I feel like my breakfast is never ending. I'm having another sandwich. It has bacon in it, egg and mayo, and also some lettuce. I'm going to show you guys my go-to fish cake, Japanese fish cake. This. I have a whole bowl of ramen. Seaweed. The main point is this fish cake, which will look exactly like the emoji shown on camera right now. And then I have the tempura, which also look like the emoji. And I'm showing it on the screen. Okay, I'll dig in now. It looks so appetizing. First, I have to put something on to watch while eating. This fish cake is so good. I have the tempura. It is prawn inside, but the batter is so thick. I just got myself a fish. Right now I'll be having a fish cake. I don't know what this is called honestly. Cake? Bakery? Cakery? Inside is the tuna fillings. Chamchi! Chamchi! It looks like a flag. Technically it's not an, a food emoji. I just found it in the random section. I end up buying two of this. They have like the pot which is the red bin. But I end up buying two tuna fillings. I was so dumb. It's legit tuna. Not the kind of flavor I expected. It's not sweet. But it's not savory at the same time. The tuna doesn't make much of a difference. I think we also have like some small slice of cucumber. I have a way to improve this, which is yogurt. As you know, I dip a lot of things into yogurt, so yeah, I will dip this into two. A little bit better. I wouldn't say it's like innovation. But yes, yeah, still better. I'll be moving on to the next food. The next one is this. I don't know if you can see that since the out focus. But this is a chocolate with quite reddish wrapping. The only chocolate that I can find which has the reddish wrapping is the Kit Kat. I think it looks pretty alike. The red and then the red right here. I love Kit Kat so much. The flavor is just so good. Oh, I just drop it. This and then the emoji. I put it on the screen anyway. Mmm. As you already know, this is not legit chocolate. It's like the wafer with chocolate on top of it. I just got myself another round of snack. This is waffle. Oh my god, it looks so good. Yeah, waffle. Waffle, waffle, waffle. I don't know why, but every single time when I have like a dessert, I just have to top it with the strawberry and it will automatically look so aesthetic. And you can see that it looks so much like the emoji. I must say identical. We'll dig in now. Mokcha. And that's about my emoji food challenge. I hope you guys enjoy it. And if you do and want to see the part two or episode two of this challenge, you can leave in the comment section and I will make another one if the request is higher. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more. Bye bye.